hey guys welcome to my channel in today's tutorial you are going to be learning how to solve my sql import problem with php my admin so before i proceed i will show you how it normally look like so let me try to import a sample database i have on my system so i'm going to click on import so select the file um select the sql and after doing that i'm going to click on go so if i click on go now it's going to process the file and as you can see it says um index column size too large <laughs> what is too large i don't know so now it says the maximum column size is seven six seven bytes so now to solve this problem it's very simple and very easy so for those who are using WAMP server you are very lucky to do this okay now what did you need to do once you have this kind of error so the first thing is to make sure you um clear everything from your database so first of all clear everything so check all and drop everything in this table so let me drop everything now as you can see i have dropped everything so after dropping everything just scroll to your tab bar click on it and you are going to find uh my uh, you are going to find one server icon click on the icon and the icon is going to pop up this uh this model then once you get this model click uh, just go straight to either your mysql or your mariadb anyone you are using so for me i'm using mysql so how do you know you are using mysql you are going to find it here as you can see mysql server is what i'm using mysql 3306 so i'm going to go directly to mysql to fix this problem so i'll click on one icon again once uh mysql so once you get to mysql scroll down to where we have mysql settings enter my sql settings and go straight down to you know db default row format so this default row format is compact so we are going to change it to dynamic we don't want compatible format so we are going to change it to dynamic now i click on dynamic so once you click on dynamic the system is going to reboot itself so you wait for the system to be rebuilt so it's currently rebuilting itself wait a little while so once it's done rebuilding um check it again check the status as you can see it says all status awards are running fine now we cannot try to import this data again i click on the database again go to imports okay select the file and i'm click on uh, i'm going to click on the same file again to go uh, square then scroll down and click on go so let's see if it's going to work this time around okay still loading so let's hold on why the um the file is um dumping so let's see if we are still going to have the same error okay still loading still loading okay okay improving just hold on and give it a moment as you can see everything imported <laughs> so import are successfully finished so um please after watching this video please and um, please subscribe to my channel please you know i'm just begging for i'm begging you guys to please subscribe to this channel i i produce videos on um coding php laravel um flutter code igniter raw php just anything related to php backend development so please subscribe to my channel please please do subscribe please thank you